heard the Dubliners. I went to a Dubliners concert, and I always wanted to be. I was playing guitar at the time, and I wanted to be a kind of a rock guitar player. You know, when you're a young lad, you wanted to play the guitar and be a rock player. Unfortunately, uh, I didn't make it as a guitar player. But the reason why I didn't really, I think, was because I went to hear the Dubliners, and I heard for the first time the man that was in this band for 50 years, Barney McKenna. And I have to say, when I heard him play the banjo, he just completely, I was hooped completely. I got rid of the guitar and got the banjo. And that's thanks to Barney McKenna, a great, great man, a great musician altogether. And, uh, and, you know, little did I ever think, uh, many, 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 many years later, uh, that uh, I get a call from uh, John and Eamon and the lads and ask them if I do a couple of concerts with them. Uh, I tell you, it was a great honour and I was delighted to do it. And um, I have to say, I want to take this opportunity to thank um, John, Patsy, uh, Sean and Eamon for uh, asking me to do the gig. It's been a great time. We've, we've, I've really enjoyed it. Thank you very much. I tell you what I'm going to do. I'm going to play a couple of reels. I've learned I learned these reels many many years ago from Barney, and uh, God be good to him. We hope he's in a better place. So uh, I know the name of the first one is called the Tulla, and I asked Barney what was the name of the second one. He said, "Sure, it doesn't matter as long as you can play it." <laughs> <laughs> so that's <laughs> we haven't got a clue what it's called. Okay, the first one is called the Tulla. <laughs> 